This episode is sponsored by AwesomeDrinks.com and contest promotions by Scrappy's Bitters. Use coupon code BLOODYAWESOME and save 15% on everything, including the full line of Scrappy's Bitters at AwesomeDrinks.com. Put down your cock sauce! Pick up your Bloody Marys! We're making a cocktail! Three times three. No Time cock three. sauce in these drinks. Is there cock sauce in here? Uh, <laughs> yes, yeah, there's exactly. cock sauce in this one. Oh, really? Well, yeah. I, uh, I stirred oh, that one funny, so you gotta, there might be some. <laughs> <laughs> the martini. Not the one you're thinking of. I used the thick stirrer. I used the thick stirrer. It's my muddler. <laughs> it measures two teaspoons. <laughs> yeah, I know how it goes. They crushed the ice and they did it down very nice. <laughs> so we've got J. Or J. Jalitha. Jalitha. Yeah. Jolitha. Dan? Dan. That's that's it. That's Dan. it. Just Dan. Dan. That's Dan. It. What did Daniel? Daniel. Yeah. Daniel That's Sine. all you can yeah. get. That's His nickname's it. Boom Boom. Boom Boom. And Derek. There's you a guy on Big Brother named Derek now, and he's got my <laughs> spelling, and I'm like, what the hell? I'm the only Derek with D-E-R, I see it. Besides, like, basketball yeah. players. Whatever. Yeah. Anyway, so... Three scrappy, let's see how they all say names. Scrappy, spicy, bloody Mary. Scrappy, spicy, Donald. bloody Mary. And the bloody samurai. Bloody samurai. Kyle, John, Knight, and Alfred. In that, uh, it's Sir Nudo, I believe is how you would say it. I could be completely Whatever wrong. Whatever you say. You but I know how to read my writing. Um, these are your three finalists. I still don't know what I'm giving them for a gift. So here's the deal. <laughs> I've got I've got a tiki, I'm giving them one of those, those, those tiki glasses I never even put on the site. The brown uh, tiki glass I bought by mistake. Oh. Uh, the, like the bowl shaped ones. Mm-hmm. So I get a tiki mug. Uh, I got. I'll give mm-hmm. him a CMC boss shaker. I just don't know where they are right now. And the, it comes with a CMC glass, which isn't this one. And uh, the Persian shaker, which a Persian shaker. I give everybody a Persian shaker. All three of them, because I have three to give away. So you all win something. Which means that's See that? So there's there's really no losers. There's no losers. The other, <laughs> the other, other twelve. Yeah. But whatever. <laughs> but, but think about it. They but, they put us through pain. Yeah. Those were two episodes ago. So right. Fucking, yeah. That, that's it's not totally. for losers. If I'm smelling a drink that says it smells like cat food. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, well, I can't it, drink it, or that's terrible. So the scrappy spicy bloody mary. This is the one that you drank all of. So yes. it was really good. <laughs> this was really good. Um, and so I thought, well, actually, Ian thought that it would be better to have both of them on the show because there are Bloody Mary masters, meaning they're your There's average consumer. There's a little consumer. more citrus in this one than the first one. <laughs> I, 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 I did that. Yeah. Well, I, I, I didn't p- contribute to the citrus. But it is good. Still good? Oh. It's still good. There's just a little too much Do citrus. you see that face? I see it every day. <laughs> <laughs> Step off. I'm going to punch you in the nuts. Yeah. He's in the middle. Yeah. He's a little scared. I don't know. Yeah, I, you know what I'm saying. I've had, I've had Ian on Ian's one side. Ian's like, you should be scared a little bit. No. You should be. I've had Ian. You know, they say the cops are most scared That's of going to domestic violence cases because it's unpredictable. I've so. had Ian and Curtis, and both of them are like five times my size on both sides That's of me. That's true. And That's true. That's not good. So this is Amsterdam gin, two ounces, two and a half ounces of V8. It's, original. it's more citrusy than the first one, but it's still Yay. good. It's still good. Not me. Me? Uh, four dashes of scrappy celery, <laughs> two dashes of fire water, lemon lime, squeeze, squeeze, uh, two healthy dashes of Old Bay. Did I go too healthy on that? I don't know. No, no. I don't know what no. Old Bay tastes like. You know, I went too healthy on the no, no, squeeze of the, the lemon, and lime. lemon lime. Lemon lime, but that's okay. Yeah. Yeah, I got tons of ginger ale. It's all natural. You can drink that other. It's, it's organic. Mary's. Soda strength. <laughs> it's organic. It's gotta be. Did you muddle that ginger? <laughs> oh, no, I've done that though. That's really good. That one. Um, stir to chill, martini glass, boom, lime wheel. We did the garnishes. Some of these garnishes could be better because we've we've reused them a couple of times because these drinks have been this made. The ginger in. These two are really complicated to make, yeah. right? Both of these required massive amounts of muddling. So here right. you could try that one. We'll Let's baseline this. these. That's the vodka, celery, garlic. Lime juice, bitters, muddled, and then you pour on top of that six ounces of tomato juice. We can strain it all out in craziness. Oh, um, that's good. It's really tomato good. juice, pepperoncini, <laughs> brine, which again things you didn't know. Uh, light beer, two ounces of Coors mm. Light. Yep. Weird. You can taste more that's spice weird. now that it's Worcestershire sat. sauce. Mm. Yeah, and then uh, that celery bitters, celery salt. Uh, black mm. pepper. This is like a meatloaf. That's yummy. <laughs> this is like a meatloaf. <laughs> Thank God without the ketchup. Because yeah. <laughs> we already had one of those. Right. Uh, <laughs> that is pretty tasty. That's tasty. That one is so good. Of course it's the most complicated one. Yeah. This one's good. It's so, delicious. So that recipe card's going home with you guys? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if yeah. you want to take this recipe card home. It's pretty pretty beat up and full of weird colors. <laughs> <laughs> 
don't even know what's on there. there. Um, yeah, that's that's mm. good. This that's is good. a drink you've got to you got to make in a big batch. Yes. yes. But still, that's a lot of work. You don't want to be good a big batch overnight. That needs to sit. Because now it's spicier. Now it's spicier. You can, you can, you can taste the onion. Really taste it. So you think, oh, so so just put it all into a big jar and overnight. Let it and then shake it a couple times yeah. and pour it out. Yeah. I guess you could do that. It does, I guess it'll. I'm guessing the alcohol would separate a little bit on the top, but the rest of it will build into like. Well, the, or even if you just made the mix. That's true, and then threw the alcohol. Then in threw the yeah. alcohol. Because it's just two ounces of vodka. Yeah. Everything else in here is just crazy. So just yeah. yeah. So just make right. the mix. The night before, and then add your alcohol as you go. Yeah. Yeah. And you could just double the alcohol. I mean, if you want to only have. And a, really, a short you night. could juice exactly. the juice celery. for a really celery. good night. Yeah. Or a good morning. Yeah. Celery or a good juice. Good anytime. <laughs> That's right. Good morning, night. This when you wake up in the middle of the night after a yes. heavy night of drinking, and you yes. like a hangover, yeah. you take a couple of these. Oh, you'll be fine. <laughs> you'll throw three times and you'll be all set. It's all good. You're right back to bed. <laughs> it's like 300 milli milliliters of uh, yeah. of aspirin, except well, it's not milliliters, but in this case it's a liquid, so it would make sense. <laughs> and boom! You put that in your body. Boom, you feel better. <laughs> it's great. And, and it turns out you drunk all the time. Yeah, it's science. You right. drink three it's of fine. these, you take four snaps of this in your mouth, and you'll be fine. It's and you're awesome. like, whoa! It, you get an instant head rush, and you go back to bed. That's yeah, what science exactly. problems. Oh yeah, if, if it wasn't a science problem, it is now. All right, so All right. this is the one, this is this is where I think things get weird, because that's pretty good. This is the most unique one unique. that was good. Right. Yes, this is definitely the most unique. So you're gonna muddle 10 pieces of, of ginger, sugar, and lime juice. Smells good. I would've never thought sugar, but Yum. with all the rest of the stuff, I guess, mm. with the fish sauce, and the half ounce of wasabi, and the quarter ounce of soy sauce, which we use the spicy Tabasco soy sauce. See, it's just, it's Two good. ounces of sake. It's really good. Tomato juice. Five ounces of tomato juice. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Uh, five drops. Five drops of both these bitters. So that's that's a good healthy dose. But you could go double. On you, the yeah, one. you can definitely make it spicy. Right. If you want to, you want to kick up the spice. But oh, and the sriracha. There's a little mm. of everything in there. I like that. Only because so I'm not good. expecting it. Uh, it just doesn't. It tastes like. It tastes like what a Bloody Mary in the Orient would taste like if they have Bloody Marys there. It's a it's a really strong ginger taste. It's yeah, so it good. Like though. if you like ginger, if you don't like ginger, this definitely yeah, would not be for you. Yeah, if you don't like ginger, you, you cannot right. have that. If but you think ginger is much like Jägermeister, <clears throat> yes, then you're not. Then you're not gonna like this. Right. But I think it pairs ginger pairs good with the tomato juice or whatever. See, the they're ginger's just really they're, good. they're so different. It's definitely between these two. Which is funny because this is the one. Well, that was the first one you had got that yeah. was like on the yeah, high. That, that typically good. happens. Is somebody like really likes a drink, and then they have these. Then mm. that's kind of where they start, and then they get these other ones. So like, wait a minute, that was really good, but then there's these, and everything changes because they're. I don't know this how you can. This is more. Those. This is more savory, I think. Well, they're all really different. Oh yeah. Because gin, I've never had in a Bloody Mary. The gin tastes really good. That's a refreshing. That. That's yeah. the only Bloody Mary for a pool. Yes. Oh, yes. That's like, your summer Bloody Mary. Right. Which I don't know if you drink. Do you drink Bloody Marys in the heat? Because I don't understand Bloody Marys very much. <clears throat> Not like hot Bloody Marys, but like mm. when it's hot out. I think of like. Let me taste. Let me see if this could pass. <laughs> let me see. I was just you, at a pool you, in Florida. You want to jog so a little bit? You, but you're see. not there now. You're just going to put yourself I know, but I'm yeah. close. I'm yeah. yeah. close. The light's so bright. <laughs> yes. <laughs> It's they are they are five thousand K. So yeah. are, no, it's five thousand. I could put my sunglasses on them and I'd really be there. It is just natural light, so you should get the same effect without the heat. <laughs> but See, the heat is what we need. You put too much citrus. You you put too much citrus and now she hates you. Uh, easily fixable. Just don't do that again next time. Yeah, the first one was good, but this is actually really tasty. Well, yeah, you can still different. taste the drink. You just it, you can taste the the higher percentage of citrus, but yet you still taste the full drink. So you, you know drink that there's this. too much of one you thing. You could drink this by a pool. Yeah. At brunch time. In a plastic <laughs> container. In no, plastic. you could be out by the pool. Yeah, they don't like you to run with glass in your hand. You could be sipping. If don't you're sit, well, well, you're not supposed you to run by running? the pool. You're just running and sipping at the same time. <laughs> How many have you had? <laughs> After six of them, you might end up exactly. running. Exactly, you're not running at all. Oh, yeah, after six of them, I'm running. I'm like, oh, look, a big bouncy ball run after it and start kicking it into the pool. After six, I'd be like, people? where's my yeah, lounge chair? Yeah. I'm going to lay right here. <laughs> well, they're small glasses. That's true. However, they're small glasses and there's still two ounces of gin in there. Yeah. These are big ones and there's only two ounces of alcohol. This one, I don't even know if it even has, does it even have alcohol in it. No, yeah, it has uh, two ounces of sake in it. Oh, yeah. 
I mean, that's funny. That's it. Like, that's this, a lot. This has sake. It doesn't, it doesn't even have vodka. Have vodka. Yeah. It's completely out there. I like that one best. So you actually have a sake and a gin, two Bloody Marys that are totally different. Yeah. That's what I mean. Like they're all well, three. Like this is different. Good. Yeah. This so is the most different. like normal. Yeah. Like, Bloody Mary. Actual vodka in it. Like this is yes. Okay. Vodka. So let's put it this way. This is your. This would win for a typical Bloody Mary. Gut like, vodka. Yeah. Yes. This is a typical vodka Bloody Mary, but it's delicious. Well, it's not typical. It's not typical. It's very good. It's complicated, but this is your <laughs> typical vodka. Right. These two are your out of the box. Oh, they're out of the box. And I would think for out of the box, that would be the best one, the samurai. This one's still. This one's really good. I know it's That's delicious. That's hotter than the other three. Mm. A little, a little spicier. It is. Yes. Um, it's a little spicier. But that can easily be fixed in any of them. Just throw a few more things of fire water bitters. See this one if you like celery, like if you like the taste of celery. It does have celery in there. Why is that? Oh, is that, it's that's the like raisin bubble. Yeah. That's what the fresh. If you really like that, like that's a fresh taste. It tastes. It does. It has a lot of definite celery. Okay, wait. Let me do one right after the other. Ready? Yeah. You can't possibly mix them up because Ready? they're completely different. I shall drink them all down. <laughs> well, as long as we get a winner by the What's end. What's wrong with yeah. that? Yeah, yeah as long as there's a winner. <laughs> Yeah, you only need to have a winner. Chicken dinner. You almost couldn't find that straw. I saw it from this angle. <laughs> Watch her. <laughs> By the third taste, it'll be one of these. <laughs> Looking into that camera. We've seen that before. <laughs> <laughs> We've seen you pull the straw out before. It's <laughs> and then she'll be in the corner, homeless eating. <laughs> <laughs> Crouched down. Let's face it. Homeless eating. <laughs> Sharing my food. Well, that's, that's wrong. He's in general, that's just wrong. <laughs> Probably because I just never heard that before. I mean, he said some pretty stupid shit. I'm never like, 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 whoa, what am I going to It was not just that, it's I the move. No, oh, you gotta have a homeless. You don't understand. I got a it's picture a of that a couple weeks ago. I'll pull it out. You know, like when a raccoon looks at you, yes. like, <laughs> <laughs> get the, away from it? It's homeless eating that guy hunt. Yeah. <laughs> my no. Bloody Mary's. <laughs> And the light comes on, you're like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there it is. Oh, he's got it. You have a picture that's, of homeless eating? That's no, me, see. homeless eating Chinese food. <laughs> Where were you? Jade Garden in Chinatown. Uh, I don't remember. Oh, but see. that's Chinatown. That's when this Bloody Mary would come in every one place. But see, you would have, you she, would have she, homeless ate that all work. over the place. What? You would have homeless ate that everywhere. It was that a Chinese exactly, restaurant? Exactly, exactly. So which is she it? Which one do you like better? Somebody it's a has tough to win. Call. It's like comparing apples and oranges. I think it's that. Yeah, I see, good. I like celery. Like, this one I think is really good. I think that's good. But I like the taste of, like, celery in my bloody. Like, this I could drink all day. I could drink one of these. I could it's drink one good. of those. This I could drink all day. Huh. So then you don't want that one. Because mm. you end up in. A Wait, head. Julie, you should try them all again. Yeah. <laughs> I have kids, so what's the difference? I mean, have you seen all the places them? in Arizona? I'll keep trying them and then I'll tell you next week. <laughs> That's true. Maybe it's better to go um, to. I don't know. Yeah. It's hard. It's tough. I told her she can send me a one in like Florida. Hmm. They have waterfalls. Okay. <laughs> it's beautiful. Where? What are we doing? Hey, rehab. Yeah. Rehab. Yeah. <laughs> he said, "Well, he's got kids." So I don't yeah. Know. yeah. He sees the passengers commercials. He's yeah. like, "Where can I? How do I, I, I get I there?" I'm friends with Pax Prentice. I don't know who he is, but apparently he goes to that rehab place, and it's awesome. <laughs> See? You get to talk to people. I was sold on waterfalls, dude. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I agree with you. I think, honestly, if I was going to have more than one, it would be this. But So you're going to have more than one? So you're going to drink that one? So that's the winner. That's the winner. Mm. That's really good, but I think more than one of that yeah, with a ginger, it would be too much. Oh, I love ginger. Uh, it's okay. Kyle wins all our contests, so yeah. it's, fine. it's 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 good for somebody else. To, that's a t that's a I mean, close it's call. It's delicious. No, it's it's very. The fact that somebody this, this can come up with man. that, like that's awesome. To de yeah. to develop oh, to, that, right? To go, uh, yes. To so, even like, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna make a bloody mary with sake. Okay. And fish sauce. And, and fish, fish sauce, sauce and all the and sriracha wasabi. and 
Uh, but then you go ho over here and you're like, I'm going to muddle the crap out of everything in my kitchen. Yeah. And then I'm going to yeah. add Coors Light to it. Yeah. Boom! I got a drink! I mean, like, how does Coors Light like get in there? Like it, it, it called for light beer. I know. You know, like, is your buddy, like, like next to you and he's like, uh, fuck this. <laughs> <laughs> then he's drinking it and then you're like, well, the Whoa, this is awesome. And he's like, no, that was on me, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> 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 it, it said light beer, and I was gonna go with Corona, and then when I went into my my refrigerator to get something, I'm like, is that a Coors Light I have, I have in Coors there? Light. I, I buried it from all the good beer, yeah. and I was like, boom, there we go. Perfect. It he's was like, like he's like, I need a little water. He's like, that's oh, right, I could have went with like, right, I could have went with like a, an amber or an IPA or like some other brown ales. I'm like, no, you know what, Coors Light, because it called for light. I will say that all three of these are the best Bloody Marys I've ever had. <laughs> so, yes. There's that. Ever. Right. But, I, yes, to drink one that all one. day, hands down, John is, boom. John's got the recipe. Yes. Yeah, right. to drink all day, I think that. But I think if you were to go, oh, what, like a... Asian food restaurant. Oh. Uh, Right. Right there. Lo mein, I mean, dim sum? Where's chicken. my you, spicy, you where's to, my spicy you tuna roll? You sell this to a, <laughs> to a restaurant that has dim sum? You have this with dim sum? Oh, awesome. yeah. Tokyo sushi, but, Sunday. Oh, hibachi. Yeah, yeah. Hibachi. hibachi, for sure. Yeah. See, now all of our, I know we've got tons of hibachi bartenders here. <laughs> they you know, that, do that it. watch the show. Yeah. Uh, you got if if you're looking to become a bartender and you need a niche area, you take this drink, you start you, you apply it at hibachi. There might be some racialness going on where they only hire people of Asian Asian descent, so you might need to be Asian. I mean, oh, David, maybe even Hawaiian, because I mean, you kind of look, you know. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Once you put that hat on. <laughs> oh yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> you, you have to make the volcano, so it's it's on your wheelhouse. <laughs> Those are awesome. It is. Where else can you light out uh, like rings of onions on fire? Where else can you throw food at your patrons? And they're all like, <laughs> yeah. yeah, get out of here! Oh, awesome white rice, sticky rice, bring it on! Yeah, that's just true. Like I need something that I can't. I got chopsticks. I need some help. <laughs> right? I just bumped my head. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a person. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here. No, there's some more. <laughs> So I guess I guess John Knight gets his his victory. Yes. And um. Yeah. I, I think yeah. for sure that's awesome. Yeah. Uh, we will definitely make that. Yeah, I'll have to send you a better write up of this than my sticky weird whatever that is. <laughs> Harry and eat that. <laughs> <laughs> and, and Ian's gonna again eat the the, the groin. Um. Oh, you're just. That's not bad. Bad. No. It's so bad. Is that a green onion you're eating? Mm. That's yeah. a scallion. Mm. Oh, they're mild. Why was it so crispy sounding? Or is that strong? <laughs> 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 it was like crispy. It sounds so crispy like yeah. celery. <laughs> that's weird. Yeah. It is. Oh, weird. Anyway, so now Ooh, now you have a reason strong. for using scallions. And the question What's today, strong? I guess, the we have onion? a question. Apples or oranges? Apples what? Are, what? <laughs> that's not a question. That's apples or oranges? Oh, because I went off. It's always oranges, side. unless it's apple season, then it's apples. <laughs> And then if it's not apple season, then they get rotted and they don't taste very good. Uh, better question of the day. Nothing? Nothing. Um, what type of hot sauce do you like to consume? What's your favorite hot sauce? Liam Buttpucker. Is that the one he likes? Yes. Yeah. Right, great. It's always got a weird name. Yeah. Hot really? sauce. Just hot sauce. Butt Buttpucker. Butt 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 Where do you find a Buttpucker? <laughs> Hanford, I think. Adam and Eve. Or your dad. And hey, my dad. Adam and Eve. <laughs> 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 That's a butt plugger. It's something yeah. totally different. Right, that's what you said. Sorry, it came in the conversation. <laughs> that's yes. Ian. What type of because Ian's butt plugger do you right like? Now. Right. No, they're texting. Uh, he's texting. No. You know when your excuse is I'm texting because he's playing 1024 and nobody, yes, yes. nobody wants to know about it. 2048. 2048. 2048. <laughs> What's 1024? Just because you can only get to 1024. Oh, is that how? Yeah, it's 24. No. Okay, oh, yeah, you're right. Well, I, I, all my all my dims are always aligned by 1K boundaries. Yeah. That's all. Oh, there you go. <laughs> that explains everything. Right. Thanks, Clarissa. <laughs> is that a fantasy novel person, too? <laughs> Clarissa explains it all Clarissa? in the old show. <sighs> he's an idiot. Uh, so, what's your favorite hot sauce? Says the guy who doesn't get the reference. <laughs> because he can. And if you say cock sauce, I'll thumb up your vote because this is the, I love saying. Oh, cock I thought sauce. you were gonna thumb up the bum hole. <laughs> <laughs> so you're still going there. We finished okay. that one. Buttpuckers. Look at that snake. I'm gonna go and shove my thumb right up his bum. Have you ever seen the South Park with Steve Irwin? Yes. Okay. Yes. <laughs> 
in, do you have a friend that starts every conversation with, have you ever seen? <laughs> Just go to ianwiki.com. Yeah. <laughs> because he has seen it all. Yes. He's like Cl oh. Clarice? Clarice? No, that's a different thing. That's, that's, that's the land. That's that's I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> anyway, you want to go to ostrich.com. Thanks to the Scrappies for sending out all of our bitters to all the people. Because what they did is they made these cocktails, but they didn't have the bitters. So I sent them to them so that they can make the cocktails. And I think everybody got back to me, which is weird. Because they could have just taken the two things and never did it. So if you didn't win, you still get two bottles of, of bitters, which is forty dollars worth of bitters. So there's that. Chris just texted me, but plug. I guess he's watching the show. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's the live stream. You can yeah. go there. It's uh, live on everydaydrinkers.com or ustream. TV slash user slash channel. I don't know what it is. You can just go to blah, stream blah, TV blah, and blah, search blah, every day. Blah, blah, blah. Nah, it's yeah, double or the shit. There's, there's, there's a drink. <laughs> um, that's it. Here. So you go to Austin Drake's, get Cows these. Is, this is speaky, speakeasy martini glass. Um, oh, we got those two. Those are the epic V's. See how it's like a V shape. Yeah. Oh, and then there's the garnishes. There's we the, don't garnishes. Want the garnishes. Don't forget your garnish. Right. We want to look professional. Right. Because garnish is important. Yeah. This is the most. Uh, uh, you know what this tastes like now? Because you put so much citrus in it. She's Orange on you juice. on that citrus. I know, see? <laughs> this All is the, the time, folks. <laughs> All <laughs> the time. You love me. <laughs> this is the best garnish ever, by the way. Look at that, see? See? Isn't that, see? That's like, you know what? And like you were afraid your celery's gonna fall? <laughs> Jam that on there, too. Don't you be know afraid. what? This is. Put it using. Ginger uh, in that way. I need the celery. You get the onion. Ginger. Putting sticks into ginger is kind of like taking tacos and putting them on a stick. That's true. Same issue. We, we talked about yeah. that. Yeah. Tacos on. You need soft tacos for the stick. Right. You do. And you always put soft tacos on a stick. Always put your soft tacos on a stick, not hard tacos, because they crack. Wait, yeah. what is going on? If you, if you can get <laughs> a hard taco on a stick. Welcome to Comic Con. Did say a soft taco a on a stick? <laughs> 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 and that is how you, you finish the show. <laughs> so you go to everydaydrinkers.com to watch all the rest. I'll put this in a playlist because it's just that that crazy. It's... We're done. We're watch all three. Cover my cocktails. <laughs>